Yeah, so I, I was giving this quite a lot of thought again because, um, you know, I, I think back to my uh, career and how um, I started trying to become a sector expert in particular areas of the football industry. And, you know, for a while I was known as the UEFA financial fair play guy because I knew the regulations really well and I'd go on TV and talk about how, you know, a team was going to be sanctioned or was in breach of the rules or whatever else it might be. And it got me thinking about all of the, the things then that I became, I think, sort of mini spe a mini specialist in, if it was the rules and regulations of football or image rights in particular deals or transfers. So effectively, you get known um, for a variety of different, quite specific subject areas, as well as obviously being the football guy or the sports guy. And I think what then is really important for people starting out in the industry is to think about the things that are happening in the industry at the time. Because I think otherwise, you or people will start um, unequal races. And an unequal race is one that, for example, I'm 20 years in the football industry now. You know, someone just out of university thinking, okay, well, I'm going to try and get as much knowledge in the next six months as Daniel has got over 20 years. It's pretty unlikely it's going to happen in that six month to 20 year span. But what happens if a new set of regulations, as they do happen quite regularly, comes out in the football industry, like the new UEFA rules or the new Premier League rules on something? You start an equal race by having the same starting position when something happens. So again, I'll give another example. If it's crypto or NFTs or the metaverse, which is huge at the moment across all different sectors, you know, I think someone could get up to pretty good speed on metaverse related things inside six months to a year and understand how that intersects with almost every sector, the different use cases you could have for that sector, and then how you could add value to that sector because of your expertise in that particular subject matter. What I'm saying is it shouldn't be that you're only ever thinking about met metaverse stuff or crypto stuff or Web3 stuff or whatever else it might be, but almost let that metaverse be the same as what FFP was to me 20 years ago. Be the person that starts an equal race on something that is very topical at the time, which means if you are a student or someone starting out in the space, the truth is you've got more time. Your opportunity cost is lower because you have less things to do than other people that are more ingrained, that have more, less time because they're doing different things or doing the things that they have the expertise in. Find the competitive advantage by starting an equal race.